Hello streamers and welcome back. Are you a new streamer trying to decide what software to use or someone curious about the benefits of different software? We got you. Today, we'll be helping you find your fit in streaming and we'll review two of our products that can help you reach stream stardom. First, in one corner, we have Streamlabs Desktop, our all-in-one solution that will get you live in five minutes. All of the tools you'll need to go live exist in the Streamlabs Desktop software and make it a quick and easy way to get your stream set up and running in a flash. Second, we have the Streamlabs plugin for OBS, which is for all of our OBS Studio fans who want to bring some of the essential features from Streamlabs desktop into OBS. We'll also review what type of creator is best for each type of software and the differences between the two and conclude with some final thoughts on both. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Let's start with Streamlabs desktop. Streamlabs desktop is the best fit for you if you're a new streamer who wants an easy to use all in one platform, stream on Mac or PC desktop computers, want the ability to multi-stream to different platforms easily, need advanced collaborative features like collab cam, dual output or multi-stream and want it all easily accessible and integrated in your software. You want a quick and easy way to set up your streams without too many windows, confusion or frills around the process or you just want some customization options for your stream at your fingertips versus having to search multiple places for things like overlays, alerts, and manually adding everything as a source. Desktop is truly a one and done solution that allows you to customize every aspect of your stream from a basic level like switching out overlays to more complex settings around audio sources and additions of apps like crowd control. Now let's discuss the plugin for OBS. Our plugin is going to be the best fit for you if you are a streamer who's already using or really wants to use OBS Studio and aren't quite ready to make the switch to a new streaming software. PC stream Streamer who prefers a highly customizable software setup, streamers who want to incorporate top Streamlabs features like overlays, widgets, and alerts without leaving OBS Studio. Our plugin for OBS brings some of our top features from desktop into OBS Studio and really serves as a good hub within the app to customize and set up your stream. OBS Studio is a powerful software for streaming, but it can be confusing for first time users. If you're new to streaming, we recommend that you watch some setup tutorial videos or pull in the plugin to make your setup easier. We also recently updated the plugin so you can stream to TikTok live as an additional destination. So now that we've given you an overview of the types of users primed to use each software, let's get into the nitty gritty of the feature set differences. There are a few main differences between the two that we wanna point out that will also help you along in your decision-making process. So let's jump into it. In Streamlabs Desktop, you can stream from both PC and Mac. We also have a mobile app if you're streaming on the go floats your boat. Versus in the plugin, you can only stream from a PC. In Streamlabs Desktop, you can set up your tipping settings without leaving. Versus in the plugin, we will redirect you to set up your tipping from the Streamlabs Streamlabs dashboard, which lives on the web. In Streamlabs desktop, you have full access to the app store with hundreds of different apps to enhance your stream, like Streamlabs music, which has copyright strike free music for you to use in stream. Crowd control, which gives your audience a chance to engage with your gameplay and more versus there's no app store integration in our plugin for OBS. In Streamlabs desktop, you can enable dual output and optimize for horizontal and vertical streaming versus in the plugin, dual output is unavailable for now. In Streamlabs desktop, you can access shared storage to house your stream recordings versus in the plugin, shared storage isn't available. In Streamlabs desktop, you can add collab cam as a source and invite up to 11 friends to join your stream live versus in the plugin, Collab Cam's not available as a feature. Now let's talk about all of the features you can use in both the plugin and Streamlabs desktop. To start, both are free to use. That's right, you can access both the plugin and Streamlabs desktop directly from our website for free. Upgrading to Streamlabs Ultra is just an option to level up your stream, which we'll talk about more later in the video. But you will be able to set up everything and go live with both without needing to pay for anything. You can stream directly to TikTok Live from both Streamlabs desktop 
up your TikTok streams. We even partnered with TikTok in September to bring you a streaming challenge within the app that allowed you to get exclusive TikTok rewards and be in the running to win a three month ultra trial. That streaming challenge showed that when people streamed to TikTok Live from Streamlabs desktop, there was an increase in TikTok Live revenue in stream. So you really don't wanna sleep on the opportunity to increase your tips by not setting up your TikTok streams in either desktop or plugin. You can customize and add alerts directly in both Streamlabs desktop and the plugin for OBS without needing additional browser sources, widget URLs, and all that convoluted stuff. You load up your software in both and the onboarding process guides you through setting up alerts and widgets. You can get access to CloudBot to moderate your chat and engage better with your audience in both desktop and plugin seamlessly. You can access stream labels directly in plugin and desktop without opening additional tabs or windows. So you can access so much more for free, but for everyone who wants even more bang for their buck and is ready to dive in as a streamer more seriously, we suggest upgrading to Streamlabs Ultra. It's our subscription and it offers you multi-streaming to two or more platforms, full access to entire widgets and widget theme library, full access to our overlay library with thousands of animated and themed overlays. <sighs> All right, we made it chat. Thanks for staying with me as I took you through the two streaming options and all of their benefits and differences. If you wanna learn more about Streamlabs desktop and plugin for OBS, head to the links in the description. And if you made it this far, drop a, what's up Kevin? In the comments. <laughs> Catch you soon streamers, peace.